I had the most fun time uh, last year, the majority of last year. I was actually trying quite a few different feeds and I had, I think I had five, five or six feed companies going and I was trying horses on some feeds and then switching them to another feed. So I really felt like I got to learn so much about what I was, what was being put into my horses and how they reacted and how more warm bloody horses reacted and how more fiery horses reacted. It was the most personally satisfying year in that respect because everything else was going wrong. I did learn a lot on the nutrition side. And um, Red Mills for me just absolutely trumped it. So I, I was so impressed with the range. I think notoriously because it's a racehorse feed company, people think it's quite fiery. In fact, someone asked me that today. They're like, what, what do you feed now? I was like, Red Mills. They're like, is it fiery? And I was like, if you want it to be, absolutely. But I've got some very fiery horses and it, it's perfect for them. Um, it's been fascinating with Hollyfield. He's he's really had a no-go bus and he's always been a bit of a CIC horse and I've struggled uh, with any length of distance um, from two star and above, oh, sorry, three star now and above. And the last couple of minutes um, have always been quite tough to get him thinking in, hello, are you at home? And Barocca, as I said, I, I I was I couldn't believe it. He finished the last fence as if he was jumping the first, and I've never ever had that in my life with him. I look back and I think of Poe, where he there was only two horses inside the time that day, one on the time and one one second inside the time. Two fences, sorry, three fences from home. He was ten seconds up on the time, and he was going to go into seventh place, and he absolutely died on me and came to a halt at a house. That having jumped around that whole course like a complete pro, there's no way in hell he would have stopped at a house, but the lights completely went out. And I just, I think, God, imagine how my life changed. We had a top 10 and a five star with him. It would have been amazing. <laughs> um, and I'm just so excited that he's now got the fuel I feel for, for the distance, really. Um, my vets and my trainers have been looking at them in, in January and they're like, God, the, their top line is just unbelievable. Their muscle is so developed. They, they, they just look incredible. So I'm feeling very, very grateful that Red Mills allowed me to join 